Yes, sirree. It's video 17. Hey, helpers, thanks for being back again. And oh, a little bit of advice, if I could, everybody. Much of the time when you're going through these videos, you'll be doing it alone because you're not in school or because none of your friends uh, at this point uh, would be around, okay? Uh, but as often as possible, try to get some of your English learner friends together for a study session, for conversation, comparing pronunciation problems, oh, reviewing vocabulary, quizzing each other on words, oh, that helps the memory so much, uh, trading American idioms, okay? Uh, so good if you can get together with other advanced English learners and do some English. Well, let's click and come down and get started. The first week, Marla bought a red car. Next week, she bought a bicycle. Ooh, and next week, again, makes it sound as if we're talking to the future. Okay, so Marla right? she says, the next week. The first week, Marla bought a red car. The next week, she bought a bicycle. Who fancy red car, Marla. Ho, 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 ho. You sporty. If you disturb with its nest, a bald eagle might scratch you with its claws. Now, see, the wording got a little botched up because of the definitions instead of the words. So, fix it all up, church. Tamper, right. Talons, okay. If you tamper with its nest, a bald eagle might scratch you with its talons. Yeah, see, tamper with, but the word disturb doesn't take the with. So, with didn't work out well when I used disturb instead of tamper. If you tamper with its nest, a bald eagle might scratch you with its talons. Miriam and Randy have the inborn ability to bike in a pair. Yeah, oh, there they are on the bicycle built for two. Oh, yes, Marla. Tandem, yes, you're on a tandem. You're riding in tandem. Oh, you have the talent for it. Oh, Miriam, take this. Miriam and Randy have the talent to bike in tandem. In the Rio guidebook, it says mooring a yacht costs $100 an hour. Ooh, 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 there's that one, Marla. Yeah, the unnecessary words. Yeah, get rid of in and it and comma and just sail away straightforwardly. The Rio guidebook says mooring a yacht costs a hundred dollars an hour. The clothes specialist had a good method for altering the slender man's suit. Oh, we know these, don't we, Asa? Yeah, the tailor, okay, yeah, had a good tactic, right. The tailor had a good tactic for altering the slender man's suit. 
I'll use this packet of paper to list any fishing equipment we'll need. Oh, Randy, yeah, you mentioned tackle for fishing equipment. Yeah, many videos ago. Okay, tackle. How about above it, Randy? Tablet. Yeah, a paper tablet. Here you go. I'll use this tablet to list any fishing tackle we'll need. Tablet, tackle. Are tomatoes good for your health? Well, you bet they are. Yeah. Oh, and Julia? Oh, okay. Your mother-in-law will, okay, be growing some in your garden. And, well, thanks, Julia. Yeah, you'll pass some along. Well, thank you. Are tomatoes good for your health? You're crazy. Yeah, you're out of your mind. Who or idiom man? Yes, we have had this one. You have bats in your belfry. Yeah. You have bats in your belfry. Yeah. The bell tower area on a church steeple. Yeah, the belfry. You have bats in your belfry. If the soccer ball comes toward you and I, please do everything you can to stop it. Ooh, ooh, that's the church item. Okay, drop. You and. Let's see. If the soccer ball comes toward I. Ooh, we wouldn't say toward I. Toward me. And consequently, you and me. And not myself. That, ooh. That bad boy myself that tries to sidestep the choice. Oh, and by the way, toward or Marla? Yeah, she says, optional, towards. Yeah, you'd have to spell it with the S. But with the S, you say towards. Without the S, you say toward. There it is. If the soccer ball comes toward you and me, Please do everything you can to stop it. I was not knowing about of the interior bleeding sore I had had since June. Oh, oh, uh, yes, Randy. Unaware, not knowing about, unaware, and then, yes, ulcer, that bleeding sore on the inside of your body, an ulcer. I was unaware of the ulcer I had had since June. Oh, look at this beautiful, I think, yellow lab puppy. I think his boy's well, awfully white, isn't he? Trump must have a hidden motive for giving that last warning about dogs on golf greens. Okay? Oh, Marcelo. Ulterior and ultimatum. Yes, Trump gave out an ultimatum, a last warning. Trump must have an ulterior motive for giving that ultimatum about dogs on golf courses. There was a third incidence of costly vandalism two hours later. Oh, here's that incidence thing. This time it isn't NTS, it's just NT. A third incident, right? There was a third incident of costly vandalism two hours later. Ooh, look at this broken glass, everybody. Our all-the-same-way vote says Church is the most humble man. Oh, there he is, kneeling so humbly. Yeah, he is humble so he's kneeling 
humbly. Oh, but the words, Julia? Unanimous and unassuming. Yeah, humble, unassuming. Our unanimous vote says Church is the most unassuming man. The old boss is getting domineering with the less experienced workers. Oh, workers? <laughs> Miriam Wright, employees and uppity. Right, the boss is getting uppity, okay? The old boss is getting uppity with the less experienced employees, okay? Yeah. The boss? Yeah. Who? The idioms. Yeah. The top banana. The big cheese. The head honcho. Yeah, he's getting uppity. Are you getting enough protein? Ooh, I don't know if this girl on the right is. She might be too thin. Are you getting enough protein? Not alert. Yep. Yeah. Uh-oh. Yeah. Off in uh, a daze, or Marcelo? Yes, asleep at the switch. I'm afraid she's asleep at the switch. Asleep at the switch. Mariana bought a black dress at a suburban store that has pearl buttons on the sleeves. Oh, <laughs> what's that, Marla? She says, oh, the store has pearl buttons on its sleeves? Ha <laughs> ha, good one, Marla. Yeah, fix it, Marla. You're the wording fixer. Y yes, get that interfering stuff out at the beginning. Yeah, at a suburban store, right. At a suburban store, Mariana bought a black dress that has pearl buttons on the sleeves. Well, then we have dress right next to the word that. That's the type wording that we're looking for, okay? Lee was not sure about the war's final outcome. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Julia, who she says the full name, Robert E. Lee, yes leader of the Confederacy in America's horrible civil war. Yeah, he was uncertain about, yes, the ultimate outcome. Lee was uncertain about the war's ultimate outcome. It's unjustifiable to let the violence go, not slowed down, okay? Not reined in, okay? Oh, but Randy? Ah, good memory and good pronunciation. Unconscionable, unjustifiable. Yeah, it's unconscionable. And then unchecked, yes, not slowed down. It's unconscionable to let the violence go unchecked. Marla should have slowed down near the icy curve. Ooh, ooh, there's Charch. Yeah, he covers his ears and winces when he hears a really bad one. Have slowed? Yeah, there's no such word as slowed. Yeah, just slowed. Right. There you go, Charge. Marla should have slowed down near the icy curve. Ooh, look at that. Yeah. Car has spun off the road and into a ditch. The without exception surrender was too hard to put up with in 1918. Oh, Asa, without exceptions, unconditional, right, and unbearable, correct. 
the unconditional surrender was unbearable in 1918. Okay, yes, the end of World War I. It's out-of-control ignorance to say Siberia is not explored. Oh, no. Elena, if you're out there, yeah, I know you'll tell us that Siberia has been explored, okay? Yeah, ooh, look at how wild and cold it looks there. Oh, out of control? Uh, Julia? Unbridled is right, and unchartered. Oh, uncharted. There you go. It's unbridled ignorance to say Siberia is uncharted, uncharted. Can a person still get free milk at the fair? I, I don't think that the free milk is available anymore, okay? It was when I was a boy. Who, who would I drink the milk? Yeah, you know, with my mommy taking me for the free milk. An energetic worker, yeah, ooh, person full of pep, full of energy, yeah, has a lot of get up and go, ooh, Marcelo, yeah, yes, we have had it, she's a ball of fire, an energetic worker, oh, and how about this for discussion, again, if you could, with a group of your fellow advanced English learners, okay, I talk about a summer highlight yeah. um, from any summer, maybe one five years ago, okay, yeah, talk about that. Down in Colombia, Andrea has always rode side saddle on Miriam's ranch. Oh, has rode Ooh, 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 Marla, yeah, that's right, has ridden, yeah, uh, do the threesome for us. Oh, she says, I passed to charge, it is his specialty, okay, okay, charge, today I ride, yesterday I rode, now I have ridden. Down in Colombia, Andrea has always ridden side saddle on Miriam's ranch. Eh, dangerous, that side saddle riding, okay? The inn in the next low area between hills has a nice available room. Ho oh, ho, Miriam, you got it right away. Valley, vacancy, right. The inn in the next valley has a nice vacancy, an available room, okay? Yeah, valley, vacancy. The officers showed great courage in capturing the property damagers. Oh, great. Yes, Asa. Valor is a good one. Yes, good memory. Valor. And yes, vandals. Property damagers. Yes. The officers showed great valor in capturing the vandals. Miriam and her crew better start picking their strawberries now. Oh, church. Yeah, there's your better. Yes, had better. Yeah. Could we say Miriam and her crude better? You could. But I think had is better in there. Yeah, had better. Miriam and her crew had better start picking their strawberries now. Okay. The police were coming, so the those not 
leaving a banned area disappeared. Oh, ho, ho, Miriam, vagrants, yes, those hanging out around a banned area, and now they have vanished, right? Vagrants have vanished. The police were coming, so the vagrants vanished. Vagrants vanished. You must leave the cabin at the end of your time off from work. Oh, leave, yeah, leave, charge, vacate, right, and then, yes, vacation, yeah. There you go, vacate, vacation. You must vacate the cabin at the end of your vacation. Is there a way to take a train ride to Duluth? Well, yes, there is. Oh, wonderful trip. Yeah. Try it, Julia. Asa, oh, great trip. Is there a way to take a train ride to Duluth? Delay getting to the main issue. Oh, we've had this one. Oh, and Marcelo. Yeah, he's... He's all over this one. Yeah. Beat around the bush is correct. Yeah, don't beat around the bush. Yeah. Get down to it. Okay. Yeah. Come on. Start in. Stop delaying. Don't beat around the bush. Oh, and it's our last page for video 17. Mariana runs faster than Marcelo but she can't jump higher than ha 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 george gets it right away he can right okay mariana runs faster than marcelo but she can't jump higher than he can you see there's no need to put can after marcelo because there's nothing to disguise okay no correctness to be inconspicuous about, okay? Yeah, but with he replacing him, yeah, you want the can to smooth the whole thing over, okay? Vincent made a heroic effort to defeat the imaginary monster. Oh, how about these three? Julia. Valiant, yes. Vanquish. Vampire. Oh, you got all three. Beautiful. Vincent made a valiant effort to vanquish the vampire. And yes, it is alliteration with the V's, everybody. Yeah. Vincent made a valiant effort to vanquish the vampire. Our servant adjusted the water knob to adjust flow. Oh, oh, servant valet, okay, in Britain pronounced valet, okay, but here in America, valet and valve, right. Our valet adjusted the water valve. There you go. Okay, there's the valet. And there's the water valve. Stuck in with the kittens, Julia knew her puppy was humiliated. Ho, ho, ho. Yeah, Marla, yes. Makes it sound as if Julia is stuck in with the kittens. Yeah, no. Yes, Marla, yes. You're so good at fixing these with scents. Since her puppy was stuck in with the kittens, Julia knew it was humiliated. Yeah. A legally acceptable driver's license is a having great worth possession. Oh, valid, yes. Remember we had its opposite 
invalid. You know, here's valid. And then valuable, right, Marla? A valid driver's license is a valuable possession. Boy, is it ever. Yeah. Obama was unclear about having a legally approved birth certificate. Yes, during the campaign. Yeah. Oh, he was he was vague about having a validated, yes, legally approved, validated. Here they are. Go ahead, Asa. Obama was vague about having a validated birth certificate. Do you think I should have my front brakes checked? Oh, probably. Oh, right away, Randy says, hoist. The car is up on the hoist, okay, so that the mechanic can check the brakes, yes, safely. In trouble, yeah, oh, in a bad spot. Oh, oh, he, Marcelo, yeah, you've said it before. Right, behind the eight ball. Boy, am I behind the eight ball now. Was that the... Yes, it was. That was the end of video 17. So we'll swing over and we'll say, see you soon, everybody, for uh, video 18. Bye-bye.